reason and playful at the same time. That is how rats are doing it. Coming from the sewers, gnawing on your feet like you were a little plant made of cheese. Does it make sense? No, because my brain is a plant made of cheese because it's almost five in the freaking morning. Get ratified. <laughs> What up, brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Matches Malone. I hope you're all doing well. Crazy story. When I started working at the first video yesterday, the sun was still up. Then the sun went down and I was recording a lot of videos. Now I am at the last thing that I have to record, sun just going up. So I have been literally working from sun down to sun up, whatever you call it, I don't even know. And I'm very freaking tired because right now it's 13 freaking hours that I am sitting here as we speak. Am I super tired? Heck yes. Am I proud of myself that I pulled through? Heck yes. And if you want to see this hardworking man every single day bringing you a fresh new deck, a part of I'm in holidays like I am right now, but I'm still doing the work when I have to. Make certain to subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 25 freaking thousand. And the moment we do, there will be an amazing freaking giveaway for all of my viewers here on freaking YouTube. But enough with the yammering. Let's get into the rat attack attack hammering. <laughs> yes, my brain is molten. So this deck is just called rat attack attack because it just sounds nice. It's like rat attack attack attack. You know, because we are a freaking rat machine gun deck. This deck makes rats so good. So freaking good. You know I love rat tribal. So maybe this deck will like be shown before the others because I really want to show this as fast as freaking possible. Maybe on Sunday or Monday, but it will not be the last deck. That much I can guarantee. I don't know which one will be the last, but this will not be the last deck. I want to throw it out as fast as freaking possible. Maybe even as a second. So yeah, maybe the sun shouldn't be up and I should have done deck tech before, but I didn't. So here we are. We have a lot of new rats that make this deck so good. So freaking good. Like the Tangled Colony. It's a three mana, a two mana, three two that cannot block. But when it dies, you create X one one rats where X is the amount of damage dealt to it this turn. So if they block it, you get rats. Pretty darn good. At a certain point, you will have to do it if they cannot just destroy it themselves, you know? So I like it a freaking lot. Another new rat that we have, of course, is Lord Skitter, the Sewer King. We already seen this in my Mono Black deck. Uh, when another rat enters the battlefield, you exile up to one target card from an opponent's graveyard, which is pretty darn good. And at your beginning of your upkeep, uh, of your combat, you make a rat that cannot block. But that's still all right. We have the Lord Skitter's Butcher. This is such an important card in this deck. Either you make yourself a rat, or you sacrifice another creature and scry to and draw a card or you give all of your creatures freaking menace until end of turn. So if you're in a stalemate situation, this butcher, that kind of is butchering a human <laughs> on a paper. I don't know, I don't even want to think about it. Please don't eat me, butcher, please don't do it. Uh, we give all of creatures menace, which is pretty insane because this rat alone right here cannot freaking do it. So uh, yeah, you make all of these rats, like the blind belly rat, you bring down the tribute to Orobi, get those rats back. You have this rat right here, you know. All of that stuff will make you rats, and then you just give them all freaking menace. But wait, there's the Song of Totentanz. Oh my lord. Totentanz means da Dance of the Death in German, of the dead. So, yep, crazy name, but hey, it's just the name of the person that is doing the song. Uh, you create X11 black rat creature tokens, and then all of your creatures get haste. So if you do this, for example, for four, and the very next turn you play the Lord, uh, the, the Lord Skitter's Butcher, now all of these will have freaking manners. If you also have your Kurumonix out, now they also have Toxic. And the most thing that happened during this deck was I destroyed people with Toxic and Lethal at the same freaking time, because all of your rats will have Toxic. Also, if you play the Karumanix and you draw more than one freaking rat out of it, you have beaten me because I usually don't draw even one deck out of a rat out of this. We are of course also playing Nashi because we like stealing our opponent's stuff and usually they don't block these little one ones. So yeah, if you can return it to your hand and play the Lord Nashi, 
you're very darn freaking happy. Uh, you can also, like, you know, return the echo to your head. You can return the uh, Reckoner, uh, the Road Captain to your head so that you can, you know, play them again and still get the freaking ninjutsu value. It is pretty darn freaking nice. But, my friends, there's one card that makes this deck even freaking better. That is the Twisted Sewer Witch. Let's put it right here so you can see the roll. Um, this brings the Wicked Roll into the play. Jungle is massive with this. Your creature gets plus one, plus one, and if this aura is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, each opponent loses one life. So that means if your rat dies that gets this, you freaking make him lose one life. So, but what happens when she enters? Well, you create a rat, pretty darn good, and then for each rat you control, you put a wicked token attached to that rat. That means if you, for example, like played your freaking uh, Song of Totentots for five, now you get four rats, or you played it for red and five. Now you have five rats, all of the other rats that you already have. You make another rat, and you put these freaking wicked counters on it. Pretty darn freaking good, because now all of your one ones are two twos, which is just freaking insane, and all of your other rats are even freaking bigger, which is also pretty freaking insane. Uh, we're playing, of course, to, uh, to go for the throat. And we're playing for a Corrupted Conviction because we have all of these little tokens that we can just sack to draw two cards, which is absolutely worth it. And if there's like a Wicked Roll onto them, now you even may, uh, make them lose one life, which is absolutely amazing. So we're super aggro, you know, we have this, we have these Wicked Rolls. Okay, you can go back here now. Uh, we have all of these little rats that we're making every single freaking turn. We have Poisonous, you know, all of that. It's just absolutely crazy. From all the decks that I've played, this and the Mono Black deck have been the ones that I enjoyed the freaking most. So, should you play this deck? Freaking absolutely, my friends. I will see if it works out in a real standard, because people now, of course, in the early access event are trying a lot of different things. But hey, this deck will be freaking amazing. There should be another card in here, but for some reason it was bugged. I was not allowed to play it, even though it was from this set. But uh, hey, I already contacted Wizard, so I hope that they will fix it. Uh, it will make you rats, and uh, it will give you rats uh, plus two plus oh if you have like six or more rats. So pretty darn impressive. It also costs six though, so is it really worth it? I don't know, maybe you would have to cut down the Tome of Totem Tons, but hey. Still pretty darn freaking good deck, even without it, maybe even better. Maybe it, it was a Timmy card that I should not have put in there anyways. So thank you all so very freaking much. 13 hours of work are done. I still have like 30 minutes to work now, uh, as you know, post-production and all of that stuff. So yeah, hardworking boy Malone. I am that hardworking boy Malone. This is the Red Trouble, and I will see you in those wicked games. We're up against Ethely. Oh, wait. Are you playing Mono Black Ethely? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, this will be the last deck that I'm doing. Like, it's 4.20 in the morning. I have to record all of the freaking deck tech still. So, yeah. It's been a long one. Usually, I do this in two times a day. I are playing Mono Black, just as I expected. Let's give him a friendly waver of the hand. Hello there. Freaking hello there. All right, let's just hope they don't have a cut down right away. That would be fair. I really, like, this is the perfect scene here. There is the Rat King. Exactly what we wanted to freaking see. Oh, Gumdrop Poisoner. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Gumdrop freaking Poisoner. Alrighty. And the Iron Crack. Okay. Alrighty. Um, so I'm going with the Okiba Reckoner right here, and another Tangled Colony. So sadly, this deck will rather destroy than, uh, you know, uh, deal damage to my Tangled Colony, but that's still all right. That's still fine, we can still live with that. Also, I will still bring down a Nashi here. I mean, these can't block anyway, so yeah. Doesn't even really matter. This has lifelink, eh? It does. Does have freaking lifelink. So, let's attack in. See what they're doing. I mean, I have both of my go for the throat, you know? That is absolutely bonkers. 
absolute freaking loot the bonkers. What are you doing here, my friend? Nothing. Well, in that case, you know, let's ninjutsu. Let's freaking ninjutsu here and see what we can steal from ya. Ooh, Karuma Nix, that absolutely needs to get in here. All right. Okay, well, two is better than nothing, you know. <laughs> two is absolutely better than nothing. All right, so uh, all the Phyrex and Obliterator. Well, that ain't gonna help you at all. Just not even freaking slightly. Because I do have exact freaking lethal here. With you, you can go and uh, I'm sorry, but trying to defeat the mass of Mono Black with Mono Black, I don't even know what you're doing, my friend. I don't even know what you're doing, my friend. Get out of here. Oh, coming into my house, the house of Mono Black with an obliterator. Is that all you have to offer? Ain't gonna happen. We're up against Carolina Annett. I'm sorry, I don't know who that is. Oh my lord, we're going freaking first Christmas. Yes, my friend, absolute freaking Christmas. I will keep this hand. It is beautiful. It is really beautiful. So, as long as you do find one land, we're super happy, you know. Totentanz means death dance in German. Heart freaking core. All right. Give him the rat. Am I even bringing down Nashi here? I'm not even certain yet. A tale of ages. Okay, all right. Tail away, age away, my friend. Um, we're bringing down Lord Skitter here. Hello there, Mr. Skitter Nose. Okay, so. We will be taking another two here, which is absolutely freaking fine with me. There will be a point in time where I will just overrun him with rats. <laughs> just that is just what I will be doing. Okay. I mean, you can still sack it here, you know. Maybe they do have the same move that I did once, where they just um, sack this to destroy this with the apple thing. Forgot what it's called. Okay, they don't. But that's fine. Um, yes. I will also just be attacking in here. Second, you drawing a card. Uh, bringing down Nashi. To ninjutsu you here. And see what we can find. Hopefully something cute. The Tangled Colony is absolutely alright. I can live with that. Okay, so... <laughs> They don't have a graveyard, but we're still fine here, you know? We're, we're still doing things. We're still freaking doing things. All right. Well, that's interesting. What does this do? Uh, the red creatures you control gain manners, which is also pretty darn good. So this is three, nine, 10, 12. It's not enough yet. Let's do this. Um. Let's sacrifice this cute little rat here. This is very darn good. Very darn freaking good. Okay, I will just attack him with everything here, because next turn we get him. We freaking get him. The guy don't, don't want to use the Nashi? Okay, all right. Don't want to use... Oh, they want to block the Nashi here. That was the right freaking call, my friend. The right is freaking... Man, this red tribal is going bananas. I love every single thing about it. I must say... Oh, light pause. Okay. You have a life gain, whatever thing. If you don't, well, then it's going to be the end of you. Audacity, all right. Well, that's 12 life, uh, 12 attack coming in. <laughs> okay, 13. Please don't have anything else. Please don't have anything else. Please don't. Please just don't. <laughs> Please just don't. 
<laughs> oh, please just don't. All right. Well, that's still okay. Oh, it's not. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Out of freaking nowhere, man. Oh, gosh. Could I have won here? I think I could have won here. Couldn't I? Play the Lord Skitter. Attacking. What? Oh, it has... It has something to say. <laughs> First of all, I miss Leopold, then I miss the summoning sickness. Oh, it really is. Almost 4.30 in the morning. Get out of here, sleep. Man, what was that? <laughs> I was about to scoop it. <laughs> We're up against Mozo. We're going first. It is Krimis, my friends. Every day is Krimis. I really like the hand. Let's freaking keep it here. Okay, Honda Ridge first. Let us see what our opponent does. I mean, as long as they're not playing super aggro, we're kind of fine. <gasps> that is like the perfect answer to my super aggressive deck. The go for the throat is nice here. Whatever they're playing, I will gladly, you know, gladly accept it. Because I can just destroy it. Yes, I don't like that. You get out of here, my friend. You get freaking out of here. So, this time I will be smart about everything I'm doing. At least I hope I will. Uh, let's get rid of the Riveteer's Outlook. Because for some reason I think that they might be getting it back. I don't know why I think that. <laughs> I really don't know why. <laughs> Another Lanowar Loam Speaker. Okay, all right. Uh, yes, getting rid of it. And... Um... Let's make more rats, shall we? Okay. So, <laughs> my rats are going insane here. Like one rat after another. One freaking rat after another. I think I will be bringing down Karumanix next turn. And then together with the Lord Skitter's Butcher, we can go freaking ham. So these no dual manlands, I'm not a huge fan. But hey, the Blossoming Turtoys, okay, all right. What are you bringing to the table, though? No red source, so we're kind of still all right here. Ooh, okay. Um, bringing down the Karumanix now. Getting rid of uh, the Turtoys. I hit nothing. <laughs> I literally hit nothing. <laughs> All right. So uh, I'm paying here. No worries whatsoever. So how much is this now? One, two, three, four, five. Yes. That is good. That is real good. Oh, there. Okay. All right. That is super fine with me. Absolutely super freaking fine with me. Because I can just play the Lord Skitter's Butcher here. Uh, give all of my creatures menace. And then play the Song of Totentons. And, uh, you know, give my creatures uh, even more power to the people. Just like haste and whatever not, you know. Okay, so. One, two, three, four, five, six. We just need to get in with two of them. The Topiary Stomperino. That won't be able to block, though. So that is still fine with me, you know? Do you think they will be attacking in with the Turtoise? I don't think they will. They do? They don't. <gasps> okay. So... I will be doing this... Bring down the Butcher. I think, you know, giving all of my creatures menace here is absolutely amazing. And now I will be making another rat. 
and uh, just, you know, attacking with everything. <laughs> they can block one of those. <laughs> good game, good game, my friend. Oh, poison and lethal at the same time. That is how rats are doing it. Coming from the sewers, gnawing on your feet like you were a little plant made of cheese. Does it make sense? No, because my brain is a plant made of cheese because it's almost five in the freaking morning. Get ratified. We're up against Tapu. I really like the new avatars. Opponent's going first. All right. I mean, we're, we're fine here, you know. We just need to, like, find some things. Hello. Hello there, my friend. Ooh, Haunted Ridge first. I almost messed up here. So, how many misses will we have with Karumanix this time, I wonder, I ponder. Also, we have the Sewer Witch. What does this do? Okay. Sounds a little over the top, but fine with me. So, we do have everything we need here, for now. I will still try to get the Karumanix down, you know? Five or more, like, <laughs> what are you even doing? What are you even doing? Okay, so drawing and discarding, which is also all right. I wish this would give rats plus one plus one. That would be so cool. Are you a graveyard kind of shenanigans deck? You have to tell me if you are. Uh, Lord Skitters, nice. I like it. Uh, I will be slamming in. Like, you know, losing the Blight Belly Red is not even, like, any of my concern. Proliferate into nothing. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> so, what do you have now? You have need four for this, so that is still fine with me. So, um, we can even play the Twisted Sewer, which would, she looks kind of crazy, not gonna lie. Virtue of Strength, all right. Okay, so I will be playing you, Lord Skitter comes down, making a little rat, getting rid of your Hamlet Glutton, because if you can return things, that is something that I really don't want to see. Now we'll be attacking in here, you're just taking it, like a man, all right. So, I mean, they still have powers, you know? Powers, they still have power. <laughs> I don't know why I said powers. <laughs> so, this is three. I always need to check if I can win, you know? Let's do this. Um, yeah, looks good. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it looks pretty good. <laughs> looks pretty darn tasty here. So they can block one of these, you know. They will still lose the life. And I will still poison them utterly. All right, and next turn we uh, give all of our creatures haste. And, you know, we just do this again. <laughs> this is just too good. <laughs> This is just too good. Haste, menace, all of the good stuff. All right. I really wonder what this is. You know, I'm, I'm slightly confused, but only a little bit. All right. They're drawing a card. They're running up the beanstalk. It's not good enough, though. Ooh, another one of these. Uh, doesn't really matter, though. So what I want to do is bring down you... A lot of my creatures, Manus. And uh, now play these. And uh, yeah. Slam in there like there is no tomorrow. Man, this deck is absolute bananas, man. Absolute freaking bananas. Just what is going on, man? This is like the strongest deck I have been playing all day. Why have I not been playing this deck first? Why have I not been doing that? Those ratatouille kind of craziness cooking up this. Oh my lord. Let him cook, man. Let him cook. 
We're up against Bernie Online. Well, duh. <laughs> That's what you'd be playing at. I'm sorry. We're going first. Okay, I really love it. Would you say it's Krimis? I would say it's Krimis. Okay, so we uh, do have the Okiba Raid boss, a Ragnar Raid, which is pretty good. We do have this finally, which I like wanted all day long. So, they're playing with the Sauron sleeves. What is here? Will the ring be flowing down? Let's give him a friendly waver of the hand. Maybe they're not here yet. Hello there. All right. Um, yes. Doing this right away. So either we draw a two drop or not a two drop. Both are okay with me. You know, the skitter's butcher is always good. Like, <laughs> I love how all of this is like, you know, just rats cooking stuff. That is just amazing. <laughs> like, why does he have this cleave, man? That is so over the top. Just so over the freaking top, man. All right. So, the butcher will... <laughs> What is this, man? <sighs> Who thought this was a good idea? I think I was the one that thought so. Alrighty. So, what are you doing here, my friend? So, we're finally up against, like, fairies here, which is okay. Like, oh my lord, why are they taking so long? Why are they taking so freaking long here? Uh, let's try with the butcher. They want to counter this, that is fine with me. Absolutely fine with me. They do want to counter it. Alrighty. There goes the butcher. So we still have the Tangled Colony here. We have the Nashi, you know, we can just... Oh, they will be destroying it, won't they? Ego Drain. Yep. Okay, so if we don't find our Rat King, we uh, will be a little bit sad. Not gonna lie about that. Not gonna freaking lie about that. Will I be taking the Nashi? Will you be taking the Nashi? No, they took the colony. Okay, all right. Well, not all right, but okay. If you wanna do that, you do that, my friend. So, do you think they have another freaking spell stutter? Also love the name. I will be attacking in. Up, oh, they're going for the throat, all right. Well, in that case, let's draw some cards. We do have the value. Oh, my sweetest baby Jesus. There it is, the Karumanix. Please, no five non-rats. Well, I mean, hey. <laughs> At least we got one rat, am I right? <laughs> At least we got one rat. That's already something. It ain't much, but it's honest work. <laughs> well, let's attack in first, see what they're doing. They have another destruct. Oh, okay. Are you blocking that one? You are the mad lad. Okay. All right. Well, in that case, let's do this. And let's give him a rat. Like, this one rat doesn't concern me too much, you know? I can always, like, go for the throat my own blight belly rat if I really have to. I don't want to, but I could. But that doesn't do too much if you don't have mana open, you know? But hey, you know, who am I to tell you how to play the game? Alrighty. So... Um, I will just be playing nothing here, passing the turn. I mean, I will just destroy one of their creatures here. Uh, then I can be doing some more shenaniganery. We will see here. You need to go. You really, really need to go. Do you have a counter spell now once again? Did you find it now? Oh, you didn't. Okay, I like it. Maloney does like it. Oh my, okay. All right. So here comes my rats once more. Um, bringing down the Skitterer, Skitter King, Skitterinho, with his 
weird nose that I really don't want to talk about. <laughs> I really don't want to talk about that nose. Are you countering it, my friend? You are the mad lad. Well, in that case, let's just slam in there. Draw another card. Corrupted Conviction is okay. I like that, not gonna lie. Okay. So. I mean, they're playing the tempo game, but the tempo game is not treating them too well, you know? Because I'm just going super freaking wide here. Make some three more rats here. Doesn't really matter, you know, if they want to counter this as well. Go ahead and do it. Counter it, my friend. See what you get from countering my rats. I do have another one of those, so it's still all right. Oh, they did find a counter spell. Okay. But you know, that also means that they're not doing anything this turn but countering this. Okay. All right. So we would still be slamming in there. Now we'll be second this one rat here because it doesn't really matter. Did I play a land already? I did not play a land already. Beautiful. Very freaking beautiful. So will you find another one of those, my friend? Will you now? We'll have to find out, won't we? Freaking won't we? It is draws a bajillion freaking cards. Okay. Preclock Pangster. So, <laughs> like this art is also so good. I love that there's so many new fairies. I, I, obviously, otherwise I wouldn't have played the tribal. But still, you know. Freaking still, you know. All right, let's draw some cards with this. The Sulphurous Spring is amazing. Um, but I think that what I want to do is just to play five rats here. <laughs> And just let me in there. I mean, it's just once more all kinds of lethal at the same freaking time. <laughs> Man, why did they bring in even more rats? The rats were crazy already, but now they're like bonkers, man. Oh, this is my favorite rat tribal. Get out of here, me. We're up against Aeneas. I tried to say it as clean as possible, you know, but sometimes it just doesn't work. I mean, right now we're mono black rats. Let's give him a friendly wave of the hand. Hello there. Hello. So, I really like this Twisted Sewer, which is just absolute madness, man. Thank goodness. Thank freaking goodness. There's no more Meat Hook Massacre. Just imagine, we should be in the meta right now with Meat Hook Massacre. Also, the card pool is so ginormous right now with this set. My lord, and there's still like one more year until we will rotate. I don't even know how we remember all of the cards, you know? I don't know how I am supposed to do that. Is this a mirror match? It's not. Okay. It is just a rabbit battery. Hello? Hello. Appreciate the kindness. So, right now we're a little bit more aggressive than they are. But we will see. I cannot block this anyways. I would have I was still about to tap, you know, to a tip to to, 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 to you know tap, yeah, whatever. Why did you not play that before? Why did you just not play that before? I wonder I ponder. Alrighty. I'm still trying to get that sweet, sweet um. Uh, Sweet, sweet freaking red mana here. Not gonna lie, that would be pretty darn cool if we could get that before the Twisted Sewer Witch. Pretty darn freaking cool. So, never seen this card. Well, sometimes you just don't need to see the cards, you know? <laughs> you just, we'll never see them, it doesn't even matter. Let's go. The gigs. Okay. All right, draw your card. The more damage you take, the happier I am. 
Ooh, that is super darn freaking good. So, watch me hit nothing here, like per usual. Yep, that's... <laughs> How many times will this happen, man? How many freaking times will this happen? The exact thing like this, you know, just never freaking hitting anything. All right. <laughs> How many times, man? Are you blocking it, little one? You are the mad lad. Okay. Once more, all I care about is getting in for the damage faster than they are getting in for the damage for me. And right now, we're achieving that goal. I mean, they're going down to freaking eight here. Up. Oh, okay. They're taking it. Okay. Your choice, my friend. Your freaking choice. So. Next turn, I will be playing that sewer, which, like, it's absolute madness, man. Like, it's not even that I hit, like, sorceries or the witch. I just hit lands. Four lands. <laughs> Why? Why is it? <laughs> this game is so funny sometimes. Like, I never hit with the Karuma Nix. Like, you can bet that if I have the rat, I will not hit. I will just not hit. If I hit one, I'm already very happy. Turn invisible. Turn invisible. Was, what are you doing, Aeneas? I, I just should stop. Also, this like kind of looks like, oh, okay, all right. And it looks like Elon Musk, not gonna lie. So, it will cost two less, question mark. Will you be attacking in though? I mean, hey, you know, you can do whatever you want here. You're attacking in with the gigs, I would just block because I have... Okay, they're not even doing it. This is super nice, though. So... Would I be attacking in with everything? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight creatures. They can block four of them. Uh, no. I will be bringing down Sewer Witch afterwards. I think that, that is the best call. I don't think that they can destroy me this turn, you know? And bringing down the Sewer Witch and giving everything plus one plus one seems more reasonable. And we found that land in the exact same moment that we needed it. Like, maybe one turn sooner would have been nice. Also, that means that after this Karumonix, there was still another land. Which means that there was like, how many do I look at? Five. There was six lands, uh, five lands in a row. Five freaking lands in a row. All right. Two less to cast. All righty. All freaking righty. Two mana dragon. Must be nice. I mean, you really should not. Really should not do this. I don't think that there's a board wipe for you right now. I really don't think there is. Or is there? Is there a board wipe right now? No? Okay. All right. So here's the witch now. Good game, good freaking game, my friend. You don't even know it. <laughs> you don't even freaking know it. <laughs> All right. And uh, now I am attacking with everything. And destroying this little rat to draw uh, more cards and deal you one more damage. Very nice. The wicked rolls are doing it. Jungle is massive. Wicked, wicked. Jungle is massive. The general of mass. Oh, these rats are going berserk, man. Another win with poison. And life loss killed them at the same freaking time. That is how we freaking do it. Get ratified once more. Ratatouille, my friends. Ratatouille. We're up against Daike. We're going first. Freaking Krimis, my friends. It really is Krimis. All right. Why can I not play it? Let's give him a friendly waver of the hand. Uh, hello there. All right, green, interesting. Also, we have a go for the throat. I almost forgot that part. <laughs> I almost did. 
The Gala Greeters. Okay. Uh, let's attack in first. Let's get rid of this while we still can, shall we? Freaking shall we? All right, eh? So let us see what they're doing next. I mean, they will have something here. Otherwise, why should they have, like, you know, played the Gala Greeters if they don't have, like, a follow-up creature? Uh, I will be slamming it with the Nashi. Are you mad now, Daiki? Are you mad? You shouldn't be mad. That's not how the early access works. <laughs> I mean, it totally does. I'm in deep in myself. I'm getting mad sometimes as well. Okay. That is nice. Return from the wilds. Um, I wish that I would have found like a red source already, but uh, somehow I'd never find these. So, yeah. Let us see if we can find something totally bonkers here. I mean, they're a ramp deck, so there should be something totally bonkers. Um, I don't really care about the goose mother, must say. Don't really freaking care about it. So, they kind of need a blocker for the Nashi, you know? They don't really care about that. They just want to ramp. All right. More freaking right. They're also playing white. Okay. Here comes Lord Skitterino. Uh, getting rid of your stupid garlic readers. Attacking in. Hopefully we find something amazing. Okay. Yeah, that's... Absolutely fine. <laughs> Absolutely fine. <laughs> uh, okay. So, um, what am I getting myself? The Rumanix and the Twisted Sewer Witch. Absolutely fine. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait. Two things. That is amazing, isn't it? Oh, yes, it is. Okay. Ending the turn here. So if they cannot destroy us this turn, I think we have a good chance of winning. <laughs> yes, that's right. <laughs> oh, Nashi. You brought me so much joy in this last game that I did. It's almost five in the mornings, my friend. And I started at seven in the evening with the download and everything. I set everything up at five. So since 12 hours, I'm sitting here bringing you nothing but pure entertainment. And now we will be doing all five deck tags and outro. So my friends, thank you all so very much. I'm happy to be back. Hey, maybe it is the fifth. Maybe it is the third video. I don't know. I will just jump them around and upload them the way I feel like it. Should I stop talking? I should. Get out of here. How much fun I had, man. I cannot even put in words. Yes. This tech deck is presented from my home because I am back. Freaking home. I don't even mean the tech deck. The outro. Oh, man. I am aware that the quality of the last two videos and the next like you know three videos or the last three videos and the next two videos will not be the best i'm totally aware of that but i still want to bring it i listen to the sound and it sounds like there's auto tune on my voice i don't know what that is all about because there's literally no reason for that to happen but hey maybe somewhere in there i don't know there was some auto tune i really cannot tell you but hey, I'm home and uh, I'm feeling very good. I'm very looking forward to the fifth when I can finally record some good quality videos for all of you. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the rat tribal. Uh, rats are even better now. It's something that I will be, um, you know, building even more on because I think that it is just a very, very good deck. And I think that you can make it even freaking better. I think that there's some things that you can just get out of it. Like, you know, the, uh, the, the Hunter Knighting that gives other people rats that enchantment maybe can leave. Maybe put just in some more rats so Karumonix hits even more freaking rats. I want to give a huge shout out to all of my patrons and members. Of course, Ultimate Guard for sponsoring the channel. I really freaking appreciate it. Uh, we had a good seven months up until now and I hope that the next seven months will even be better. 
And uh, yeah, to all the new subscribers, if you're watching still here now, trust me, usually the quality is better. I hope that you watched some more other of my videos because holy smoke and Jesus, it wasn't good. There was even some part of the, of the floor <laughs> missing, so yeah. And hey, if you are still here, please put a little Maloney Sewer King down below in the comments. I would appreciate it very freaking much. And remember, my friend, and if you're waking up tomorrow morning, and see the beautiful, beautiful face of yours in the mirror, that all of you are pretty freaking sweet. I'm Matches Malone, and I will see you all tomorrow.